Hey guys, Verlis here, bringing to you more Fan Fridays. So, what we have here today is a double battle, and a lot of people were kind of not happy with last week's Fan Fridays, and I am honestly don't know why. Sure, they weren't the greatest battles, but remember, Fan Friday, well actually a lot of you, I started Fan Friday back when I have 2,000 subs, but Fan Friday is an idea that it's there to be a critique. It's there to have some form of way to show off not always the best battlers. Sure, I like doing a lot of sweeps and a lot of crazy things, but last week I just really wanted to showcase what it was about. Showing what's wrong with players and how they battle, so there's more learning from it. Even if it's a very cringy battle, that's the idea. So I don't even know how this one really is going to go, and that's the idea. I want to treat uh, Fan Fridays kind of like if I'm experiencing the battle for the first time too, what my thoughts are, and then use it afterwards with a review for a learning experience. So it looks like pe people are trying to bring out Pikachu. And I like this this setup because Ninetales used to be the old drought go-to, and now it's really not anymore. So Trevenant and Ninetales pretty much be like a Trevenant and um, Charizard Y setup. But Ninetales can have more speed, and Ninetales can have the ability to just not get one-shotted by a rock slide. So... Kangaskhan goes for Fake Out Nine Tails. It was good protect read right there. And how much damage does Pikachu do with Volt Tackle? Hmm, interesting. Not the craziest amount, but it did do stuff. So, Trevenant using Forest Cursed. I see. These are the kind of battles I like because they're not the super high battle level. It's just kind of this is what a fun battle is and how you can learn from it. So Kangaskhan goes for Sucker Punch on Nine Tails. Did a lot of damage right there. And Nine Tails goes for Heat Wave. This is going to hurt. That hurt a lot. That's actually a really cool combo to see. Protect into Force Curse and then a Heat Wave on the Super Effective for the cleanup. Not bad. So I can see that also working really well with uh, Charizard Y. See, it's these little battles that you can actually learn some fun things from. Oh, and Ferrothorn is just going to be gone. So Ninetales uses Protect, probably to scout out the Sylveon, and then have Sylveon get hit by Forest Curse. That's brutal. Just a full tank Trevenant using Forest Curse to set up for Ninetales. So Ferrothorn used Toxic. And also with the way that Drought is in, Trevenant will get his Harvest all the time if he hits below half. So this is actually a really good way to just kind of keep Trevenant healthy and just bounce around a lot of damage. I mean, damn, that's a pretty effective way to sweep right there, in, in my opinion. So, this... And then using Curse on Sylveon, just to prop that... To proc the Citrus Berry. Interesting choice again right there. So I guess that's for the secured damage on Sylveon. Uses Moonblast on Ninetales. Gets KO. Toxic won't finish off Trevenant, but... Sylveon's pretty much done with, uh... Burn and moon and a curse on it. So I'm go I'm curious if that'll knock it out. Oh, oh! I think it's gonna do it. I think it's gonna do it. And that's what we have. Curse. I like I like this Trevenant set. Curse, forest curse. I'll you're pretty much just doomed to die. Okay. So I don't really have much critique about the battle, like from that super crazy learning standpoint. But this is a cool strategy. I really like it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, at least for the strategy, and I hope you all have a nice day.